Hello there. In this video, I'd like to share with you the reason why every company, be it sole trader, be it partnership or proprietary limited, should have your very own board of directors and its benefits to you as a business owner and as an organization. I'll be right back. Welcome back. The role of the board of directors in a company is to represent the shareholders' interests in the day-to-day -day affairs of the company. Now, in major organizations, the diverse backgrounds of the board of members would provide a breadth and depth of experience in all areas of the business. And their position is to advise the CEO and ensure that the company decisions are geared towards achieving certain strategic objectives. The decisions taken should be intended to grow the company and to benefit the shareholders. But what if your company is owned by a few shareholders? Do you really need a board of directors then? What if your organization is just made up of yourself and another partner? What if your company is only you? The value of having a board is not only to keep you, the key decision maker, accountable. It is also to provide you the opportunity to bounce ideas off people of different business experiences and backgrounds and expertise to gain better insight into the challenges that your company faces. As an entrepreneur, your success depends on your ability to make your business work and sticking to your principles even when the odds are against you. However, this stubbornness can also prove to be a great downfall for your business if you persevere with a bad decision. Therefore, having a board of directors or a sounding board can really add value to your business. So how do you go about building your own board of directors or sounding board? Well, firstly, you need to define it. You have to define your own version of what a board of directors should consist of. It can consist of an individual person or a group of people with the breadth and depth of business experience that is different to yours. Utilizing such a group will be able to provide the strategic insight that you require in order for you to bounce ideas off and get the value in return so that they can suggest some things that you may not have thought of. By defining your board of directors and the pickup and type, it then brings you to the next step. Set your criteria. Your board of directors should consist of people whom you trust and respect, who have some form of business experience and who ideally should have subject matter expertise that is different to yours. They should also consist of people whom you could have a spirited discussion with and yet even disagree with without feeling emotionally bad about. The reason why I brought the last point in is to clarify and to ensure that your board of directors functions specifically as a board of directors with minimal emotion involved so that the adequate and the proper business decisions can be made. Once you have defined the type of board of directors you would like and you have established your criteria for that, the last thing you need to do is go and find them. Once you have found them, you need to approach them. You need to be prepared to offer them something of value in return to come on board with you to work with you on your business. If you understand the value that you can add to your business by surrounding yourself with people whom you respect and are well informed, either with your board of directors or even with a business consultant or advisor, then you owe it to your own success as a business owner to do just that. Doing otherwise will rob you of what you can achieve in the future. In the comments below, share with me how having a sounding board has benefited you in either in your life decisions or your business decisions. I would like to hear about that. If you'd like more information on how you can go about finding the right people, you can contact me or if you want to know more information about the challenges a rapidly growing company faces and what they can do to overcome them, you can download a preview of my book 20k to 2 million in 2 years absolutely free by clicking on the link appearing now. I look forward to hearing from you about your experience in your sounding board and I'll see you in the next video.